Hello everyone and welcome back to this channel. Today we are going to study about data registers. Data registers how we can use with the timers in FATEC PLC. But before start this video, please like, share and subscribe this channel. This way you will be never miss upcoming videos from Praveen Automations. Already I explained about this program. This programs we designed for reverse forward logic for one motor. For example, this is our Y01 motor and Y1 is a any Y1 is our basically drive or contactor any you can think. We will give the name also, we'll use the comments how we can use the comments in the program. And for example, this is first M0 is our main start stop we will give the chem start program s t e r t we will give the comments also to you complete understand how yani this is our main program have to start and this is our stop we can make this one emergency or what any a m g simply go here and click it okay after you can got your emergency comment also and this is also you can main program right main pro gr main program start main program only n of i think so main program this is our m200 is our main program and our lecture is now about what the data registers, how we can use the data registers in timers. Timers you understand already how to use this timer. You can simply go to the functions and you can click it here and you can got the timers. See, this is the timers and counters. You can well go it here after you can click it. Okay, no need. This timer you understand how you can take this. The T200, this is a one second timer. And how we can take this is this timer with data register. Then you simply you click it this one ok I'll simply click this one ok and here you write it t200 this is your timer address and here you give the value and value now you giving here means when you using in the program if anywhere in uh, physical so you can't uh, give that uh, value every time open with laptop or what you have to be give like to be change the value every times or sometimes you have to be take the data registers for example i will take it here d200 give the same name and this is the t200 and i give the d200 and this d200 you will be take at the hmi and after which value you will write at 200 that's value will be uh, counted in this t200 memory and click it ok and now your timer is ready with data registers and when you like to change the value and how much value when you put it on the d200 this value will be stored in t200 next in this program have another data register we will choose this is the t202 this is also we will give the address d202 after you will be give the address from D200 and in next this one have a T205 this also we will use data register D205 after you will be give value from D200 one more have a timer we used in this program this is the T208 and we will use that D208 same as you give the also have the name yani yeah, this T200 is name forward reverse forward delay and this timer is the what's the name forward time motor forward time and this is T205 what's the operates our M302 M302 is our for example forward this we can give the forward command can give the name forward fwd 
फॉरवर्ड यू कैन गिव द नेम एंड दिस इज योर रिवर्स कमांड आर ई डब्ल्यू कैन राइट द रिवर्स एंड दिस इज योर वाई जीरो कमांड एंड दिस इज योर फॉरवर्ड कमांड यानी सॉरी फॉरवर्ड कमांड एंड दिस इज द रिवर्स कमांड एंड वाई जीरो इज वेयर दिस सी आर एम थ्री हंड्रेड एम थ्री हंड्रेड इज योर वाई जीरो कमांड सो एम थ्री हंड्रेड दिस वन इज एम थ्री हंड्रेड दिस इज योर रिवर्स यू कैन गिव द दिस ऑल्सो नेम हेयर रिवर्स आर ई reverse time this not we will give cancel this one and this timer you will give this forward delay already you have this if you like to give the uh, any comment you can can give it here number for example motor we can give no problem m o t o r This is your any M three hundred is motor, and this is also this M three hundred two is also your motor. Not this one. This one M three hundred two is your also motor. T O R motor. Maybe this comment is not okay, but you can write in your own way when you making the drawing. After you can use the comment names. Which you choose, you can write it here. This is only for learning purpose. I will tell you how you can write the comment in the program. So now almost our all program is ready, and we will download to the PLC this program. Go to the auto check and check your com port is shown now. Click it OK and download this program. Stop the PLC. it will be now checking and downloading this program now our program is ready in the plc and we can make it a run condition it will be asking again are you sure you start the plc click it yes i want to start the plc now what what we do first there is a d202 d205 d200 it already have value you have to be right from plc you have to be give here if you like to change the value for example i need to give this first data register needs 6 seconds and this i needs for 5 seconds for example i will give 5 second and this one also 5 and this is also i need 6 seconds for example this is will be this is the delay we will give 2 seconds or 5 seconds if you like give, give 5 seconds no problem and now you can start your program we'll take it little here and after you will be complete see this y0 and y1 you can be see it here and as i give the make it on condition sorry here we have to be go and i make the on condition see now our first y0 is on and after it started after 5 seconds wait after y 1 will be start and this value if you like to change from the hmi this is your for example this is your hmi data when you have to be write some value you have to be go to the hmi and this data register directly forward to the hmi and you can write it there from the hmi and this value will be stored in your program For example, this is the six C D two hundred is a six value. I would like to change the eight. It will be move the eight. And where is your? Uh, this is your reverse time. For example, and this is your forward time. T two hundred five. T two hundred five is a five. Five. Also, you like to change? I will change this one. Also eight. And this value will be moved in the. D two hundred five, and now it will wait for five seconds. 
this is 8, 8 seconds running now it will be wait for 5 seconds and after 8 seconds this y0 will be run and after wait 5 seconds after your 5 seconds uh, 8 seconds this will be run if you like to reduce this time you can reduce put it here 2 for example i will put it here 2 and also you like to be put it here 2 2 seconds 2 seconds wait now it will be it will be wait for only 2 seconds and go to the forward condition see it's a 2 seconds wait and this value also if you like to for 4 seconds for this example i will put it 4 here and not this one sorry this one if you put 4 also it will be run 4 4 seconds after 4 seconds any reverse 2 seconds wait 4 uh, after 2 seconds wait 4 seconds forward this look like it will be done how much time which, which you like to write from HMI this data register you have to be used so this way you can change your time value from the uh, HMI in your program it's very simple and easy and if you not understand anything send me the message in comment section i will give you feedback as soon as possible inshallah will be next lecture i will show you the physical hmi how we can change the time from hmi thanks for watching allah hafiz